What's going on folks? My name is Josh and I am the Outdoor Dude. We're back again. This time I'm at a popular dam river fishing spot. There's a marina off to the side above the dam and there's some below the dam faster current fishing to do. So let's get in it and see if we can get some fish. Bye. Look at that big mama jamma folks. Now this is a pretty popular fishing spot. Tons of people come here and park all the way down the side of the road for walleye. There's a bait shop right here, right next to the marina. So here's a lock right here. Tons of bluegill and panfish down in there. So I'm looking for the deeper water. I'm looking for redemption where I lost a small mouth. Most people are in here trying to fish for trout and walleye. They're not in here running for bass like me. Nice fish right here on the bank. About to get one. Oh, he nosed in on it. I don't know if you could see that, guys, but there's small mouth down, right down there in front of me. Just cruising. Caught one here on a Kitek before, so I'm thinking it'll be a, a good deal. All right, we're gonna move. We may come back to this bed fishing a little bit, but if I can, I'd like to fish without bed fishing at the moment. Got a toothy, toothy fella. Come on over here, bud. <laughs> Got a good dancer. <laughs> oh no, you got my swim bait. Well, quick release on him. Won't get. Go on. You're free. He broke me off right at the bank, and I was able to, I, he knocked my swim bait out of his mouth right at the same time. He's toothy bastards. I got lucky and was able to quick grab him from the water. And you're not supposed to lift them up out of the water like that because they will break you off. I'm only using 10 pound monofilament, but I was trying to get my fish grips around the dang thing's mouth, but it wasn't happening. All right, we got a fish. We're gonna retie, check back with you. Sorry about that wind, guys. The wind just picked up like crazy. So I'm, I'm just bouncing around, fishing the marina side, fishing the river side. It's called Seneca River, guys. Very, very high pressure, very public fishing spot. This right here is the spot, guys.
hard time figuring them out. If I had a boat right now, the whole front of that boat would be covered with rods. just getting warm enough in there where the smallmouth are starting to bat up and spawn but in this running water it's going to be a little colder one more spot left that i want to try over in here before i get rocking I call this video a bust hello not too bad in yourself back in my next spot guys water's moving a little faster down here so I don't think that the bass are in spawn yet not in here let's see if we can get a nice small mouth yep fish 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 oh yeah yes 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 Yes, river smallmouth, guys. Man, he fought way harder than he is. About the same size as the one I caught the last time in here. They fight pound for pound, one of the hardest fighters in the water, I'd say. Such a good fighting fish right here. We're gonna get a good shot of the release on him. Wow. Let's just say, guys, make sure you have the appropriate casting room behind you. This is what's behind me. I hooked a bush behind me, went to cast, got an incredibly bad backlash, and I should have known better because this happened to me before. The first time I come to this spot, it's turning into an every time thing to where I backlash so bad I have to re spool completely. I didn't have to cut the whole thing out, but I did have to end up having to tie one. I didn't have to tie it, but I did tie one messed up backing knot. Didn't do my best work, but it's going to get the job done for now, and we're going to keep fishing. Tie, I'm going to get that hook back on, tie on a new swim bait, and we're going to get it out there. Water just went down like a foot or two out of nowhere. So it's looking like they're uh, slowing down the release of water at the dam right now, and... Uh, now I can stand a little further away from the shore. It's awesome how that happened right after I backlashed and needed to retie, but that's okay. We're gonna sail it out into that current break, see if we can nail some more smallmouth. Got a fish. Oh, don't be another pick roll. Slime darts. Compare that to my swim bait. Got 
Got him. Got this. Oh. Trying to bed fish for this smallmouth right here. Tons of suckers and all sorts of stuff in there. Such a nice day. Fish. Small mouth. Yes, guys. This couldn't be more stoked. Got a good smallmouth, another one. Oh, it gets real shallow in here now, guys. They're letting a lot of water. They're, stop, they're stopping the flow on some of that stuff. Real fat belly on this. They're feeding up. Here you go. Go on, go back the other way. There you go. Oh, you're freaking out. <laughs> Trying to use utilize as much of this Kai Tech as I can. Go, oh, all right. I'm in the mud now, guys. In the mud. But what seems to be the pattern right now is throwing this Kai Tech. It's obviously really shallow right here. There's a current break right out there where it gets deep again, and that is where I'm having my my success. Are you out here to the right at all? No, okay. Yep. Yeah. yeah, I've got uh, two smallies and a pickerel already over here. Got a fish. Small mouth. Just a little guy. Oh, he took my swim bait right off the hook. Nope, took the hook. Holy, I just got bit right off. Quick release. Come on, buddy. Yup, another smallie. Yeah, yup. Oh, he's freaking out. It's all shallow, bud. You got it. Go. snagged right there. Something over there with teeth. Something just chopped Just chopped that end of it right off. Yeah, the first, same spot, probably about five, 10 minutes ago, just took the hook and everything, broke me right off.
guys, that's it. I gotta go get my nephews off the bus. Guys, if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button. Smash that subscribe button right there. Make sure you hit that notification bell so YouTube notifies you when I do a new video. I love every last single one of you that subscribed. Guys, if you like this type of video, check out this video. Or how about that one? And I'll see you guys next time.